Salt. A little while back, I prepared a video called Salt Saves Lives. In that video, I stressed how critical salt was to human life. And as many of you already know, whenever anyone is hospitalized for a period of time, they are usually placed on a saline intravenous drip. Saline is 0.9% sodium chloride, or the common salt you eat every day. And to keep you in the best possible shape, an average saline drip for an adult is about 3 liters a day, which amounts to 27 grams of salt, more than five times the amount that is currently recommended. Let me repeat that to make sure that you are in tip-top shape for any hospital or surgical procedure. Patients are given more than five times the government recommendation for salt consumption. That gives you an idea of how wrong the government recommendations for salt consumption really are. I was just reading the New England Journal of Medicine and noticed an article on the current shortages of critical hospital materials. Amongst the most important was saline, that simple solution of salt that we eat every day. And just to give you an idea of how important physicians believe salt is to our health, just look at this quote. Referring to saline, the authors of this article state, in many ways, it is more the lifeblood of hospital care than blood itself. Now this bears repeating. In many ways, it, referring to saline, that simple solution of salt, is more the lifeblood of hospital care than blood itself. So, the next time you hear all those government bureaucrats repeating that old, outdated dogma about how we all have to reduce our salt, think about the doctors who are on the front lines saving lives every day, saying how critical salt is to good health. Salt!